Hey guys, Brian delivers you the goods here. Sorry my hair is a little puffy this morning. I just was sleeping for a bit. Um, I woke up a little over an hour ago, uh, but I still feel like drained and tired, honestly. So, yeah, I'm returning to you for an album review. This is for an album that I wanted to check out myself to see what I thought of it. And this is for Caliban's. A uh, new album, Dystopia, that I ju just got done listening to and going to be reviewing. So I'm going to discuss what I listened to for this album and let you know my thoughts on it. So let's dive into this review, uh, this album review. Now, they are a metalcore band, but they do experiment a little bit in this album. So, yeah, what did I think of this album overall? I think the beginning was uh, staying on point with what it was going for up to the middle of the album. And then, there's a few songs I don't know if I like, but still, Dystopia, the title track featuring Christoph White Zorik, I believe, White Zorik, I believe is how you pronounce it. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it w-i-e-c-z-o-r-e-k i might be pronouncing it wrong so please forgive me if i did uh for his last name so yeah i really enjoyed the track it was a great opening song the opening song to this album i meant to say was a really outstanding song i really enjoyed it even the screams from the lead singer of the band sound really good for the caliban band um, so, 5 out of 5 for Dystopia, I really enjoyed it, it was such a good song to open this album up. Ascent of the Blessed was another great song, really enjoyed the screams from the lead singer of this band, uh, Caliban, so, it was such a outstanding song. I like the screams, I like the heaviness, the progression in the drum work is pretty amazing. So, 5 out of 5 for this one. Virus featuring Marcus Bischoff, I believe, is how you pronounce it. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. Uh, sometimes I have a hard time pronouncing German last names. <laughs> so please forgive me if I mess up on what I'm trying to my pronunciation is messed up or whatever, if it's messed up or whatever, so, yeah, uh, Virus was a really good song, really enjoyed it, um, a lot of scream and progression in the, like, the heaviness in the song is very progressive with the guitars and the drum work, it sounds really good, and the guy singing and the feature artist's screaming too as well sounds really good so five out of five for me on this one phantom pain there is a lot of singing in the chorus of the song and it doesn't sound that bad but yeah they kind of overdo it with some of the clean sings a bit but it it works in my opinion with certain songs it just depends on the song itself so, 5 out of 5 for Phantom Pain. I did like the chorus a bit. It sounded pretty good for what it went for. And the screams in it are pretty amazing. Alien. I think it goes to the chorus a bit too much for Alien. I didn't hate it. I just... I think it goes to the chorus quite a bit. But, in my opinion, I think it works with what it goes for. Um, and the screams in it are very good. But... It has a lot of repetitive, cor the chorus is very repetitive, meaning it goes to it too much and relies on it too much in this song. So 4.5 out of 5 for this song. It's solid for what it is. Next we have Swords, and that was a pretty amazing track. I really enjoyed it for what I went for. So 5 out of 5 for this one. Um... Darkness I Became was a really outstanding song. I think it was the last song I gave a really good score. 
uh, except for Alien, because Alien, I gave it a 4.5 out of 5 due to it going to the chorus too much and relying on it too much in the song. Um, Darkness I Became was really outstanding. In my opinion, I loved it, so 5 out of 5. Dragon featuring Johnny Davey is a decent song. I personally didn't feel for this song too much due to some uh, screaming from some girl in the song or whatever, and I'm like, this is not that interesting and not that appealing of a track to be liking. So it was kind of bothersome for me, in my opinion. But 4 out of 5 for Dragon, it, it didn't sound bad, everything else sounded alright, but it was the bridge part where the screaming comes in from some girl or whatever, and it just, no, couldn't give it a pass, so, yeah, 4 out of 5 for Dragon. Uh, Hibernate was a really good song, I really enjoyed it, 5 out of 5 for me on that one. The songs get a little longer towards the end of this album, like four minute songs, so it's pretty well done. Mother was a really good song, really enjoyed it. Um, five out of five for that one. I like the screams in it from the lead singer and the progression with the guitars and drum work sound really good. So yeah, the world breaks everyone. Uh, it does rely on the chorus quite a bit, but I think it executes very well for what it goes for, and some of the verses are pretty outstanding, so 5 out of 5 for this one. And finally, we get to Divided, and that song was not too bad. There is some trap beats through some of this album that is relied on too much in this album, and for this song, it does it in the verses and I don't really like it that much but still the album did execute pretty good so 4.5 out of 5 for divided I don't like the trap beats in the song but everything else about the track is not too bad so 4.5 out of 5 for me on this one um Overall, production, mixing, and execution, I think Caliban Dystopia was a pretty good album, in my opinion. There is some metalcore stuff it, that I do enjoy, but then there's some trap beats and electronic beats that I don't know if I can get behind, and some girl screaming in the eighth song, Dragon, that I couldn't uh, give a pass for it being a well-executed track, so it wasn't a well-executed track, it was just a decent song, everything else was fine in that song, except for that section of the song, uh, but overall, I think Caliban Dystopia album was pretty good, I highly recommend checking it out when it comes out tonight, I think at midnight for the album, or sometime tomorrow on April 22nd, so first score for me, I'm giving Caliban Dystopia an 8.5 out of 10. This was a pretty good album, another pretty good album that I've listened to for this Friday's releases. Uh, I've heard good and pretty good albums so far this Friday, for this upcoming Friday, for new releases for albums. But I wasn't disappointed with this metalcore band, Caliban. They did pretty good, so... 8.5 out of 10 for me. Comment below. Let me know what you guys thought of the Caliban album, Dystopia, if you've heard it. And if you enjoyed this album review I made for you guys uh, this afternoon, or about early afternoon, probably going into sometime this afternoon, comment below and let me know your thoughts on it. Tap a like on this video if you liked it. Subscribe to my channel if you can. Support the channel. I'll have another review coming out. Uh, I think I'm going to check out Primus's new album, or Primus's new album, or however you pronounce it. I'm not 100% sure, uh, but it's not a new album. It's an EP I'm going to check out, an extended play. It's only three songs, but I'll give it a listen and see what I think of it. I just got to find it first. So, 
for download and all that. But anyways, I hope you enjoyed this album review for Caliban Dystopia. Keep in mind, I'm just expressing my own opinion on what I thought of this album. You don't have to agree with me. If you enjoyed the album a lot, that's great. I did too. I think it's pretty good. It's just there's a few tracks I don't know if I can get behind on. Like three songs, Alien, Dragon, and Divided. Those songs are not my favorites, but everything else, 9 out of 12 tracks are pretty outstanding. So, yeah. But stay safe, guys. Take care. I hope you enjoyed this album review for Caliban Dystopia. And as always, I'll see you in my next review.